family members with any veterans, make sure to give them an extra special hug or a kiss or some cookies today because today is their day. So thank you to all of our veterans. Big shout out to you guys. Now let's get on to today's video. What is up guys, Mystic7 here, and today we're going to be focusing, at least for right now, on these five top Pokemon, aka the Laprases, because... Right now, until November 23rd, there is a super awesome Lapras spawn event that looks like this, and it is available only in Japan and nowhere else in the world. Because why would the rest of the world be able to get this event, be able to have Lapras spawning everywhere, right? That's just not fair. That's a screenshot of a radar in Japan from a user looking at all of the Laprases that have spawned. There is a Lapras spawn event in, again, in Japan only, because screw the rest of the world, and uh, they are catching Laprases out they're like Pidgeys, and I'm very jealous because I've I have five right here, uh, but the only ones that I ever caught were the 198, the 1047, and the 1480. I guess the 1480 that wasn't a bad catch with Frost Breath and Dragon Pulse, so I'm I'm okay with that. But the two best Laprases I hatched because I never find them in the wild, and they are now spawning everywhere in Japan, which again little unfair because I mean like I get we had the Halloween event but I'm assuming Japan got rare spawns and Gengars and shit spawning everywhere too like it wasn't just us so they are getting Laprases and we are getting cluster spawns which is nice right we still got cluster spawns today actually is the last day of cluster spawns and we will be going not to the Santa Monica Pier because we have gone there literally every day for all of these updates we are going to the Long Beach Pike I have not been to Long Beach in a minute so we're gonna go there I need balls really bad because I am super low and uh, today is the day to stock up because this is the last day of cluster spawns and of just super duper uh, item drops from Pokestop. So we're going to go to Long Beach. We're going to hunt these last little couple hours of cluster spawns, see what we can catch. Hopefully, maybe a Lapras will spawn at Long Beach because Long Beach is notorious for the Lapras and Blastoise spawns. So we might get lucky. We probably won't. I feel like we should considering, you know, Japan with the Lapras event. But uh, that's going to be the plan for today's video. So if you guys have enjoyed this cluster spawn and just big Pokeball event, uh, make sure to leave a like on the video and comment down below and tell me how many Pokemon have you seen at one time because at the pier I have a screenshot I had like maybe 10 to 15 Pokemon in one area not by a Pokestop too just at the end of the pier so it was pretty intense so hopefully we'll see some of that at Long Beach I am very optimistic because Long Beach is just great and I'm assuming it's gonna be awesome for this cluster spawn so let's head out there and maybe find a Lapras so before we go to Long Beach I just want to say that I did not get any like screen recordings of it because Airshow the recorder that I used is no longer supported recording because Apple keeps piping them with updates so I think they just gave up and then I do not have uh, there's another app called BB record I have it on this phone I don't have it on this one this one I forgot to bring so I couldn't record my screen but I still like obviously you know I like, recorded with my camera so we went like a little bit of a throwback style for today's video but hope you guys aren't too mad about that but let's get to Long Beach well I uh, got here and realized that my screen recorder is still not working so this is the best I can do but we found a Dratini right off the bat which is nice getting the candy up I actually have enough Dratini candy to get another Dragonite I just just haven't been prioritizing my evolves lately since the whole Halloween update so hopefully this guy goes down and that'll be a good first catch not the first catch but a good no no yeah see there it is I can't download air show meaning I can't record meaning that uh, so today's video might have to be throwback record style I have this app called BB record on my other phone so I can record on that I just forgot it at home I also can't catch this damn Dratini oh my god come on I don't want to Oldsberry Oles Raspberry Ultra Ball but it's looking like I need to stop being so mean there we go we got a great <gasps> nice there he is cool so we got the Dratini 245 CP not gonna keep it so we'll transfer out almost 300 Dratini candy which is awesome but uh, we got the lucky egg down and we're gonna go over that area and see what we can catch. Here's a perfect example of the Long Beach cluster spawn. There's like, well, one, two, three, four, five, six Pokemon, including a Bell Sprout, which I need very, very badly. So we're gonna grab this guy, 300 CP easy. You know what? Not, we're not even a Raspberry, bro. I'm just gonna straight up Pokeball. So yeah, again, sorry that I have to record like this. Uh, I didn't, <laughs> I didn't choose this life. But yeah, so Air Show. I think Air Show is discontinuing recording, so I'll no longer be able to use Air Show, which means I don't know if I can use my iPhone 7 to record when I'm playing uh, or trying to you know, make a video, which kind of sucks because I was going to use my other phone to make a mini account, which would have been fun, but I don't know if I can really do that anymore. But we got the Bell Sprout, whatever. That's all behind the scenes crap. So Bell Sprout's down. That's awesome. That's good candy. Bad IVs, I'm assuming. Yeah. So 120 Bell Sprout candy, almost enough to get another uh, Victory Bell, which is awesome. So 14 minutes left on the egg. We got a Squirtle and a Bulbasaur in the nearby, so we're gonna just keep walking around. Just wanted to show another clip of this place. Just look how crazy this is. There's actually like a ton of people 
uh, chilling over there. You can't see it, but they're like probably 20 people just kind of sitting in the shade because it is a hot day today at Long Beach and everyone's just kind of catching because these are all lured up and it's just spawning like crazy. So I mean, there's a machop, there's a horsey, there's just so much stuff right in this area, but nothing big or rare spawned yet. I can't find the Bulbasaur or Squirtle. I want those really bad, but I mean, I guess we're gonna, I'm gonna grind all of these Pokemon, get as much XP and Stardust as I can and just have a day. So actually we got a bunch of stuff happening right now. We have a 5K egg hatching. Actually, there's probably a couple of them hatching. So Porygon. Eevee, you know what? Oh, there we go. So Eevee out of a 5k. That's new update right there. So that's awesome. 599 Eevee. Let's see the IVs on that. Nice. That's going to be an evolution right there. Also, we have a Squirtle, which is cool too. And there is a Bulbasaur, at least like, I mean, five, five feet that way. It's over, over there. So we'll grab that too in a second. But let's get the Squirtle first. Low CPs, easy catch. One hit acquitted. Nice. Yeah, 13 CP. That was a baby Squirtle. So there is the Bulbasaur, and it's like right over here. There's also an Oddish and a Ghastly on the nearby, so it's it's pretty good. It's a good day today. Yeah, here we go. We found we found Senor Bulbasaur. Look how nice of a day it is right now. This is just, I can't even see the screen. Yes, yeah, so this dude's 445 CP, so this is kind of a big boy. It'd be nice if he has good IVs, but the likelihood of a wild Bulbasaur having good IVs is lower than my IQ. Oh, God. Money. Nice. He's down. Sweet. So we got the... Bulbasaur. Cool, that's good candy right there. So 445 CP. Yeah, worst IV is possible. So we have a 60, now 66 candy for a Bulbasaur, which is great. And then here, I guess here's an example of the just massive amounts of items you get from the stops. That wasn't great. I need balls too, if you look. I'm, I'm so low on Pokeballs and everything. So I'm kind of, I'm trying to catch everything while I have the lucky egg up, but at the same time, I'm trying to like conserve balls. Ah, blah, blah. And now we've got the Oddish, which is, remember, Gen 2 candy. Actually, 458, he's kind of a, kind of a big boy. We'll use, we'll use a great ball because I'm literally out of Pokeballs. Sweet, okay, Oddish down, almost 200. Oddish candy, so we are for show ready for generation two. And I just got another bell sprout. I know you can't see it because you know, no screen recorder, but I promise it happened. But that's kind of why I like coming to Long Beach every once in a while because it's not like Santa Monica in the sense that Santa Monica is super duper small and compact, and you catch a ton of Pokemon in a super small area like Long Beach. You have to walk around to get everything, but it's got a lot of Pokemon that you don't normally see at Santa Monica, like the Oddish, like the bell sprout. Um, now, Ghastly. So it's nice to come here every once in a while, but it's even nicer when we have a screen recorder that works. But uh, today we found a Tangler and there's an Oddish here, and we've got full squad. Everybody say what's up. What's up? What's up? Yo, yo, yo. Cam, hey. If you're watching, I like you, and I hope to meet you. This looks better than Falco. <laughs> and I'll kick your ass with three months. months. <laughs> All right. What what's what CP is everyone's saying? 23. Thank God. Did I get the biggest? I got like 1100. Wow. <laughs> oh crap! I got a big boy. Oh, yes, there we go. Thank you very much. <laughs> got it. All right. We'll knock him out. And there's also an Oddish here too, oh, which is nice. Need that Oddish candy. Everybody. Oh wow! One hit or quitter. Everybody get theirs. Yeah. Did you get yours? Yeah. yeah. Yep. That's his Pokedex Tangela. Oh, just Congratulations. Show you, show you. Crap. Can you check if it's hey, how much time? How much time? How much time? It's above average. Yeah. Nice. Yep. Nice, that's in the Pokedex. Yeah. Congratulations. Thanks. Yeah, above average. So, I think this was the last catch of the uh, the Long Beach grind day. So, peace out, everybody. <laughs> yeah. We've actually got some exciting stuff right here. As you can see, I am level 28 and I'm at 299,951 XP, and I need 300,000 to get to level 29. And we've got a Nidorin or Niran right here, ready for. Uh, the level launch, so we're gonna curve that, knock the grate, and then if he, if this thing runs on us right as we're about to hit level 29, I'm gonna be so peeved right there. <gasps> Don't do it, you bet. Mm. Oh, I thought he was about to, okay. All right, here we go. Yeah, so we are about to literally hit 29. That's so awesome. We got him. That means we are now level 29, which is great because the goal for me is to hit level 30 before Gen 2 drops, and I'm assuming Gen 2 is dropping uh, December, and we only have like about a month to get one more level up, which, I mean, it seems easy, but trust me, it's pretty hard because each level is just, like, so much. So, bam, then a screenshot that, and we are now level 29, which is awesome. One level away from, let me get one more, one more. Oh, I'm also going to tweet that. If you guys don't follow my Twitter, it's right below me, but we are one level away from grabbing level 30, which is pretty much the max level when it comes to Pokemon CP, so that's the most important level you want to be, and that's the level that I want to be 
100% want to be before Gen 2 drops because that means I can show you guys the max CPs for all of these brand new Gen 2 Pokemon and obviously for the Gen 1 Pokemon because again once you get level 30 that you can't like the, at level 30 you see the highest CP whether you're I don't know what I'm trying to say basically once you get level 30 you can't go higher in CP so once we are there and Gen 2 drops you guys can see the highest of the high when it comes to Gen 2 Pokemon which is gonna be awesome so we have 111 out of 350,000 XP needed for level 30 but we are going to get there 100% going to get there before generation 2 drops so that was awesome little cool way to end today's video and that was today's video hope you guys enjoyed that again happy veterans day to you and all of your family members who might be a veteran and if you guys are not from America and you don't celebrate veterans day then hey happy it's a it's a free holiday for you guys to pretend to uh, celebrate so go, go get a beer or something tonight or, or a juice box if you're not 21 or 18 wherever you live whatever but that was today's video a big shout out to Japan for shizing all over us with their Lapras event. We did not find a Lapras at Long Beach. I wasn't really there for that long. Um, so hopefully we'll be able to find one. I might go to Long Beach tomorrow night to actually go for like a big four hour grind session. So if I do that and we get a Lapras, then that will be lit. But if we don't, then that won't be lit. And that's just how life works. But that was today's... I'm going to stop talking. That was today's video. If you guys enjoyed that, if you did, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, comment down below, and let me know how many Pokemon you've gotten in a cluster before because the event is officially